On the count of three, one, two, three, finish the ride! You may have seen them during warm-ups or gearing up their bikes. Last week, bikers and runners teamed up at the Finish the Ride and Finish the Run event, a movement that came from something greater. So Finish the Ride and Finish the Run is really the spirit of determination to overcome tragedy and to move on. Go! Have a great ride, ride safe! While Finish the Ride and Finish the Run may seem like a fundraising event for the organization, the event actually has a deeper meaning. It's an event that I started after my own tragedy. Um, when I was hit, pinned underneath the car, dragged nearly a quarter of a mile from the streets onto and down the five freeway at freeway speeds in 2013. Um, my right leg was ripped off in about 20 pounds of flesh in two minutes. And, and after that, I got back on the bicycle, but I also started to understand the issues of traffic violence and how deadly the roads are across Southern California for cyclists, for pedestrians, for drivers. Bikers and runners not only embark on runs and rides, but they also become advocates for awareness and change. I think events like this bring awareness. Two important things like Safer Roads are, are vital. If you think about it, if you raise enough awareness, that awareness can turn into action and you can save lives, even if it means by making streets safer. That is something that saves lives, which I think is honestly what it all comes down to. Members of the community can continue to come together for ongoing safe events, where it's not just a ride, but a movement. For Canyons News, I'm Shalisa Krolpan.